Today, I found a mod that turns a normal Ibushi Corvette into a pickup truck that maybe is the best truck in the game and the world. As you can see, it's an Ibushi Corvette, but as a pickup truck, which is great. We don't need big trucks. I think this is enough. A small car that you just convert into a pickup truck. Why would you need a big truck with big wheels, dangerous to the public? gonna have this i honestly like the way it looks i like the way it looks more than i like the normal pickup trucks the bed maybe is a little bit smaller than a normal truck but i don't think it's a big problem it's rear wheel drive there's a front wheel drive one but i wanted to choose a rear wheel drive because you can do stuff like you know small drifting even though it, right now it has very low horsepower but trust me there is a lot more to this mod by the way let's look at the interior here we have a a nice normal we should call it interior and back we have like this window if we back up you know we can look there we can look at our load in the back which is great and oh i think i should better look at the road next time honestly we can even make a small durability test we're just gonna go straight and see if anything is gonna break we can drive like into the bushes and i don't think See, I don't think anything bad is gonna happen. The radiator is broken. The engine is smoking. It has no oil. It's overheating, but it's okay. I think it's losing power. I don't think we're gonna be able to go up to so. Come on, man. Just don't stop. Yeah, the engine is gone. But now, let's spice things up. But before we do that, we're close to hitting 2,000 subscribers. So if you just like and subscribe, that will help me a lot. So that's kind of about it. A sports version. That's right. It has a lot of power, which is great. Look at the cool racing brakes. It's red. We all know that red means fast. Dude, the handling is great. The engine sounds good. It has a turbo, as we can hear it. It's it's very nice. I'm honestly going to fall in love with this truck. It's so good. It's low, which is cool, you know. I see some low trucks. They look awesome. Even though, of course, that's kind of like against the point of having a truck that is slow. But still, that's cool. You can't deny it. You may argue about that, but that's okay. Everyone has their own preference. And the way how it looks is just on point. Tiny ducktail wing or something like that. A small spoiler in the back is cool. I think even straight pipe exhaust. Also pretty cool. So sort of, what is this guy do? Oh my god, what what did he do that? And now he's stopping like he didn't do nothing. We are not gonna care about that. We're just gonna continue driving. And we can honestly drive this truck like a race car. I don't think it's a problem. We can drive as fast as we want. I feel like I'm the one piece with this truck, you know? I feel every single bolt that it has. I feel everything, okay? No, but on a real note, it actually, actually feels... Not bad, okay? That was my problem. This version is not for drifting. It's more for driving fast, and I'm not quite the best at driving fast, okay? Oh no, oh! Oh! Maybe it's a sign for me to go to something that is slower. Maybe fast cars are not for me. A drag version, that's <laughs> goddamn right! Look at that! God damn! This thing is fast. This thing rips. Oh my god damn! Oh yeah, let's go! That is insane, 180. That is nice. I hopefully do Why is this guy there? The fact that we didn't crash this actually is kind of surprising. That makes me kind of happy, I'm not gonna lie. Come on, get fast. Oh, 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 no, 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 don't crash. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, come on, let's fly, baby. Careful. Oh, no. What the f No. It's also burning now. That's not a good sign. I'm just gonna forget about what happened. Could you use a drag car as a daily driver? I think yes. I think you could. If I had the ability, I would do it. I mean, I don't see any problems with it. If you're still not convinced, then I don't know what can convince you, okay? This car is great. Oh! Damn, that was a, that was a heavy crash. Now let me show you something else. There's something like this, which is honestly very cute. Look how it opens. I mean, dude, the level of detail on this. I mean, damn. That's nice. But what I'm wondering is, how many rocks can this truck fit in? That's a question of the day. Right, so right now we have a rock that weighs 400 kilograms, which is, you know, a bit heavy. Still not as heavy as your mom. As we can see, even though it's kind of heavy, that is like nothing for a truck like this. I mean, it does go, you know, a little bit down here, but that's okay. Even at high speeds, the handling is pretty good. As you can see, we can do things like that. It is still staying stable and not doing any wacky stuff, okay? I think that means one thing and one thing only. It needs more weight. Okay, so now we have two rocks, altogether 800 kilograms, which is a little bit more than last time. And as you can see, the handle's great. It's like feathers in the back. <laughs> okay, well, maybe maybe it is sticking out of the window. That's like doing the lowrider thing. 
It's like a new option that I just invented. I'm trying to make it like spin and do some bad stuff and I mean it did work right now but it's like when you actually try doing it and oh the thing is popping out I'm not gonna lie it's not great. I think that means one thing we need even more weight that's right guys. And by the way, those are two rocks, it's not one. Okay, so I made a decision to add one big rock. Hopefully it's not gonna fall out. This rock is ginormous, as you can see, it barely fits in the car, but it's moving. I mean, that's quality right there. I'm gonna be honest here, it's barely moving and it's about to fall out and now it's overheating. That's like the only one issue that it has. Even- No, no, oh my god, don't fall out. Oh man, it's barely holding. And okay, the engine is damaged, now it's not driving. But even that was not it. Alright, there it is. I'm not gonna lie, I really like the way it looks. Honestly, I don't know what to tell you, bro. It's just good. It has really good off-road capabilities. I'm gonna show you that. I'm not gonna have to drive on a road. In this car, you don't even need roads. You can just drive like this. And the suspension is really good. And... Unless I don't crash, nothing bad is gonna happen. You see this mountain? I think we can do it. We go here, and we just don't break. Oh, come on, it can do it. It's just a little bit of motivation. Trust me, it can do it. Maybe it can do everything, but that's okay. Here we have, for example, a normal Ibisu Comet. And of course, the normal Ibisu Comet is smaller, but it's not that much smaller. The difference is not that big. I like it. Look at this guy, why, why did he do that? Look at them, why are they? Oh my god, why did they? They both crashed! Now I crashed too. And it is also my homie Ibishu Kave that I crashed into. And this stupid guy. He can go. Even though after I crash like this, it still drives. And now I'm wondering what can kill this truck. Oh god damn it. The engine broke. If it didn't overheat, it will still drive for a million miles. But there are some other models that I think are gonna really surprise you. There's this thing. I honestly have no words. I don't know what to say. This is insane. It has like 1,000 horsepower. This is... Oh my god, this is crazy. I don't know why it would make something this fast, but... Damn, this is cool. Oh yeah. Look at the speed. This can go even faster. Jesus. Yeah, the brakes work. Overheat, but they work. I want to see the top speed. Come on. Oh, dude, it's hard to keep this thing in one place. Can we go a bit faster? Yes, we can. Yes, we can. No. Please. Oh. Okay. Now we survive. But let's just repair it for this one test. There you go, and now, let's go. I'm not even gonna use brakes. 220, that is insane, come on. 230, oh my god, okay, not using brakes. I told you I'm not gonna use brakes. Yeah, oh my god. Dude, look, <laughs> look at that. I guess that's kind of about it with this mod. But before the video ends, I just want to let you know that we do have a Discord server. People there are very friendly, so feel free to join. Link is gonna be in the description, so that's gonna be it, and see you in the next one.